Y'all, I just droned at my favorite place to drone in California. Uh, surprisingly, it is an industrial area, but I fucking love flying my drone over here. Right now there's actually like a police chase or situation going on. So there's a helicopter flying around, so I had to go ahead and take down the drone because I didn't want to interfere with whatever the fuck they're doing. Sorry, it's real close. <laughs> Seth Lawless, if you guys know who Seth is. If you don't know who he is, check him out. He has a uh, like a special series coming out with Vice about um, abandoned malls around the country. And he got to go like photograph and film inside a bunch of abandoned malls around the country, which is really fucking cool. So Seth, good on you. Can't wait to see the stuff that you have come out. I was up in LA and I got a notification from Stringer that they needed footage of an, like this mall that's mostly abandoned and they needed footage of the stores that are still open. So I went up, I filmed, and then uh, they had another one ping in Santa Monica. So I went over to Santa Monica, it was like a 25 minute drive, uh, I got a fucking parking ticket so all the money I made off of Stringer I have to use to pay for fucking parking ticket. I'm so pissed. I'm gonna roll my windows up so you can hear me speak. Let's do that. Yes, that's much better. I should also attach you to my safety, safety safe, safety, safety spot for the GoPro. What am I saying? Oh, the fuzz! It's the popo! The popo is out today. Look at them. Just popoing it up today. Woo, buddy. Yeah, buddy. I, I am a nosy Nancy today. Both y'all either got pulled over or there was a collision situation that had to be taken care of. So right now I'm on my way home. You know, I went up for a meeting in LA. I was kind of hoping that Stringer would have some stuff pop off and it did. I love that it's a uh, very like LA, Long Beach, um, Orange County based. I love that it's all over Southern California. It's not just like in Hollywood or whatever. Uh, whatever situations happen, they kind of ping you and sometimes they'll even text you to see if you're available. If it's like a couple hours out or a day out, they'll hit you up. Um, if you guys are filmmakers and you're trying to figure out how to like freelance more, how to get a little bit of extra income without having to do Uber or any of that stuff, Stringer's a really good way to get a little bit of extra money and get experience when it comes to filming newsworthy stories, which is something I've wanted to do for years. Um, it helps with like being a documentarian as well. It's just more practice. Um, and I honestly love it. I love, I love getting to drive my car. I love my car. I'm in, inside Daryl right now. My car's name is Daryl. What's your car's name? Put it down below. I want to know. In 2019, my goal is to freelance more, even more than I have been. I wanna work more, I wanna push myself harder, I wanna do more, I wanna film more, I wanna go more places. I had a meeting with somebody in the adult entertainment industry to do some lifestyle stuff for them over the next year, over the next couple years. And uh, we just had our first meeting, really, really excited. Can't wait to show you guys what we're gonna be doing, where we're gonna be going, and it's gonna be an opportunity not only for me to film lifestyle stuff, but it's also gonna be a chance for me to A, travel, 
and B, it's gonna be an opportunity for me to get more stock footage and more B-roll, which is what I was just doing. I love Stringer. I love that Stringer is available everywhere, but I love that it also gives me an opportunity to capture stock footage and sell stock footage on websites like Adobe Stock and Shutterstock. And I know Vimeo and YouTube are trying to get in the game with stock footage. If any of you guys are interested, if you know anything about YouTube stock or Vimeo stock and how to really get involved, I've sent out emails, but I mean, it's easier if you know somebody that works there. So if any of you guys know any information, please do let me know, pass it on to me either uh, on Twitter at KNAgonio or on Instagram at no.tracers. That's where you will find me. That's where you find my uh, photo and my video stuff. But this is just a quick little vlog. I know that my videos haven't been getting as many views as they used to and that's totally okay with me. I know that YouTube is cycling out the old creators and there are new creators and new content coming in. So I wanna be a part of that influx of, of new content people are looking for. So uh, with your help, 100K by the end of this year, I really would like to shoot for 50K, but somebody said 100K and I was like, okay, we're, we're gonna go for it. We're gonna go for 100K this year. It's January, so we got 12 months to make it happen. Um, but yeah, this is, this is my first couple stringer assignments of the year and I'm loving it and now there's traffic. So it's going to take me 30 minutes to get home from fucking Carson. Sick. We're going a whopping four, a whopping four miles per hour. Oh, now we are stopped on the freeway. Los Angeles, you go 75 and then suddenly you're going four on the freeway. Good old California knows how to traffic. California knows how to traffic. Oh, I shouldn't say things like that. I hope you guys dug it. Let me know if you did by giving me a thumbs up, subscribing, notifications, eyes in the sky, all the things that YouTube does now that they didn't do. Annotations are going away, which is annoying because it's going to change everything everything about YouTube, especially all the older videos that had annotations. So yeah, thanks for that. If you guys are freelancers and you need tips on how to freelance, how to get started, how to make a website, how to, you know, just get, get the ropes to just look at this airplane, just flying down the center of the freeway right now. Woo buddy. Can you imagine? What if that was you? What if that was your plane just flying over the freeway like this? That's crazy shit. My drone goes higher than you, plane. Zam. Ooh, look at that bicycle. Anyway, if you guys dug this, let me know. I will see you in the next one. Stay strong, keep enduring, go out, create something, and uh, be safe in the new year. Yeah. Oh, oh, Tesla. Oh, it's so pretty. I like the red. I like the red. That's the Model 3. I like the Model S the most, I think. That's just me personally. Give me a Tesla. No, I want to film Elon Musk. Fuck, fuck, fuck having a Tesla right now. I just want to meet the guy. Uh, but check out the podcast, Project Freelance. It's a weekly podcast where I help creators like you create better content. Like me, I guess. I don't know. But yeah, weekly. Look at this Tesla.